And welcome to ETV, entertainment television everywhere in the Treasure Valley. I'm your host, Brad Rowan. Well, with Halloween just around the corner, you'll want to stick around for this show because we've got a little trick-or-treating lined up just for you with some ticket giveaways and also some chicken giveaways. But first, it's time to take a look at our new movies. Sean the Movie Guy has a new one lined up for you that you might just enjoy for a third week in a row. Here he is to tell you more. Why are you trying to kill me? Why would I be trying to kill you? Because the last time we met, I tried to kill you. That was a long time ago. Some people hold on to things like that. There's a nifty little action comedy opening up in theaters this week called RED, which stands for Retired and Extremely Dangerous, as in a group of former CIA operatives who are called back into action when somebody targets them for elimination. I think we ought to discuss the fact that the CIA is being used as a hit squad. And they'll do whatever they can to find us and kill us. We're getting a band back together. Bruce Willis stars, and he's always been good at mixing action and self-effacing comedy. And he's not alone this time, as his co-stars are an eclectic mix of notable actors, all of whom gamely tackle both the action and the humor. Hardly ever get to work with uh, a bunch of actors that you're a fan of. And I think the, the big shining light of it is that every five or ten minutes in the film, a new movie star shows up. You're taking it to a whole other level. Yeah. Look pretty happy about it. Also gamely tackling action of a sort is Johnny Knoxville and friends returning to the silly stunts that made them famous in Jackass 3D. This third installment in the series is more frat boy antics and general stupidity, except that this time around, it's all in 3D. And that's what's with the movies this week. I'm Sean McBride, the movie guy for ETV. So tell us about Red. Yeah, Red is a lot of fun. You know, Bruce Willis is very good at playing both the action and the self-effacing comedy, and he's got a great uh, co-starring caster. Just really quite like Red. It's the one to see. Sounds great. Now, what's new with the flicks? Over at the flicks, uh, we have a we have a pretty good one. It's called Never Let Me Go. It's uh, Kira Knightley and it's uh, Carrie Mulligan. Basically, what happens in the future if children are being raised to raise human organs for donations? You know, what if they're not people? They're just donors. So, mm. good little science fiction flick. Check that out over at the flicks. Interesting stuff. And uh, anything new on DVD? The big one on home DVD is How to Train Your Dragon. Of course, that's going to be the big one. And Sean, I heard we've got another contest. Got another one from our friends at Carl's Jr. They're the hand-breaded chicken tenders. And we decided to make it a little movie trivia thing. So what we want you to do is send us an email to etveverywhere at gmail.com. Uh -huh. And here's this week's trivia question. It's really not that difficult. <laughs> In what movie did Burt Reynolds play a driver whose team was sponsored by a fried chicken magnate? So think about that. If you know the answer, then send us an email to etveverywhere at gmail.com and you could win some hand-breaded chicken tenders from Carl's Jr. Sounds awesome. Mm -hmm. Well, I know that we've got a lot of local theater coming our way this month as well. A ton and of stuff. So. I think we might need a full segment for that. So, uh, All right, we'll pick that up later on. Sounds perfect. So stick around right after this. Local theater with more from Sean the Theater Guy right here on ETV.